This is your LMAX Exchange technical update for Monday, December 19th, 2016. Euro dollar. So a bearish development in the euro last week with the market taking out critical multi-year support in the form of that 104.63-2015 base. And this drop now exposes a fresh downside extension potentially back below parity in the weeks ahead. At this point, the market would need to see a break back above 108.75 to take the immediate pressure off the downside. Sterling dollar. So cable has been very well capped on rallies up towards a previous base at 128. And while the market holds below that level, there's risk for a continuation to the downside with the market potentially trading back towards the recent 31 year low just under 120. Dollar yen. So dollar yen continues with its impressive surge. The market has now broken up through critical resistance in the 115 area, taking us up thus far above 118. At this point, clearly 120 psychological barriers are in sight, though daily studies are overextended, which does warn of the possibility for a short term correction before we see a resumption of gains or any additional significant upside from current levels. Euro Swiss. So Euro Swiss has recently broken down below a multi-week range and this puts the pressure back on the downside with a focus now on a retest of the 2016 low at 106.24. Aussie dollar. So Aussie now is pushed pressure to the downside as the market takes out recent support with this accelerating declines now confirming a lower top at 75.25 and accelerating declines towards next key support at 71.45 further down. Dollar CAD. So Dollar CAD looks to be resuming its uptrend after the market was very well supported on dips ahead of 130. The most recent support comes in at 3081, which is now a projected higher low ahead of the next upside extension back above the recent highs that we saw at 135.89. Kiwi dollar. So Kiwi continues to break lower over the past several weeks and this latest breakdown below 70 opens the door for the next major downside extension towards medium term support which comes in at 66.76. SPX 500. The S&P 500 traded up to a fresh record high last week, just shy of 2300. And while the market holds above 2100 at a, really at a minimum, it does keep the overall structure constructive and the possibility for additional upside to fresh record highs to 2300, 2400, and 2500 further up. This uptrend has been relentless. At this point, though, at a minimum, we would need to see a break back below 2180 to suggest some form of topping is in place and open the door for a potential meaningful correction. That 2180 low comes in from the 5th of December. Gold. So gold has seen some intense setbacks over the past few weeks. The market has now traded back down towards 1100, but daily studies are now oversold and it looks like the market could be putting in some form of a base over the coming sessions. But we would need to see a, day, a break back above recent highs around the 1165 area to take the immediate pressure off the downside and confirm the possibility of basing in this market.